apart the price of the property, yeah. what are the different taxes we the buyer could have? Once, once I mean, apart from the purchase price, agreed purchase price, the buyer needs to pay the taxes. If it's a new property from the developer, it will be paying IVA, which is uh, VAT, a value added tax, and that will be 10% at okay. this moment. If it, in Andalusia, if it's a resale property, depending on the on the price, there will be a scale of uh, percentages. Mm. So, between I mean, up to 400,000 euros, the buyer will be paying 8% tax. Okay. Between 400,000 and 700,000, will be paying 9% tax, and then from 700,000 up, it will be paying 10%. Uh, that will be tax. Then it needs to pay for the um, uh, notary, for the, the, the expenses of the notary to, to do the deed. It depends on the value of the property. We could say somewhere nearby 0.3% approximately, but just as a guidance. And then the, for the registry also, it's a small amount. It's uh, about 0.2% if we are to say you know some figure as a guidance and then um, most lawyers uh, they will be charging one percent of the business volume uh, sometimes if the if there are more things for the lawyer to do or if it's a very complex uh, purchase for whatever the reason uh -huh. or, or something the fees might be increasing or you know that will be but in general terms, 1%. So what we normally say is when you are going to buy Marbella, you need to have, you need to count the purchase price and add 10 or 11%, 12, if you want to be mm. completely sure. But okay, that's it. Oh, it's very clear, Rafael. Thank, Thank you. you. <laughs> Thank you.